Hello guys, Barry from Coffee vs Glass here and one of the things that I like about my Android phone and Google services in general is that they offer a service called Google Photos Backup. Uh, now this is basically a service where you can upload everything you take on your phone from the camera roll uh, up to a Google Plus account. Uh, now there are two options in terms of quality you can have. You can just upload the full resolution photos and if you do that, the storage that those photos take actually counts against your quota for your Google account so you will start to use storage if you take a lot of photos. The other option they offer is to upload the photos in standard quality, which is around 5 megapixels, um, but in that sense you actually get unlimited storage, so you can store as many photos as you want through this auto backup system from your phone. So I have it set to that because it allows me just to take as many photos as I want on my phone and they get uploaded to Google Plus into a private folder and they're just stored there forever and it's unlimited, which is great. One of the things that annoyed me about it though is that it wouldn't back up any other folders of photos that I had on my phone. For example, Instagram. Once you take an Instagram photo, it creates an Instagram album in the gallery app and stores all the photos in there. But the Google Plus Auto Backup app or system didn't actually recognize that folder and back up those photos too. It would still just do the camera roll. Recently, however, they've updated this, which it now includes extra folders on your phone that it can back up automatically. So what we're going to just do is we're just going to take a look at what that looks like and how you can actually make sure that feature is turned on so all of your photos on your phone are backed up. Now there are a couple of ways to get into the Photos Backup settings, but in this case we're going to be doing it straight through the Google Plus Photos app. So if we open the app drawer, we're going to find the Photos app. Now this is actually the Google Plus Photos app, not the standard gallery app that you have on your phone. Once we go into it, it will open up our photo viewer and it will show us our gallery. Now this is actually going to show all of the photos that Google Plus has actually backed up. What we need to do is we need to find the option that says Backup Folders and actually see what folders there are that it's backing up. To do that, we can just go to the menu at the top right and we're going to go to Settings. Then what we're going to do is the top tab up here is Auto Backup Settings. If we scroll down, we'll see the Backup Local Files folder. This is basically going to allow the phone to back up not just the camera roll but the other folders that we talked about earlier. Once that's ticked, we can go back to the main photo gallery menu and we can pull out the sidebar and go down to this new option which is folders. As we can see in here now, we've got WhatsApp, Instagram, download, camera, screenshots and another Instagram folder which is actually for the videos. Now essentially, once the blue cloud on the right hand side has been ticked, this means that it's going to start backing up that folder and you'll see when it's complete as well based on the notification you get on your phone. If you wanted to untick a source, or if I didn't want it to back up WhatsApp, I can click on the cloud and it will stop backing up those photos for me. You'll notice that when you scroll down, the camera one's got a little padlock next to it. That's just simply because you can't turn that off because this feature by default is backing up your camera roll and you can't change that. But it's really great to see that you can now have the option to back up extra folders other than your camera roll. The only one annoyance with this, however, though, is when it backs up all these photos and it puts them into your backup photo stream, I guess you could call it, um, it doesn't segregate them off into different folders. So when you log into your Google Plus uh, through the website and you go to the backup photos folder, it's just an endless stream of photos combined with camera roll, WhatsApp, Instagram images. There's no way of separating them out. So I wish that they would allow it to back up Instagram images, but back them up into a separate folder called Instagram backups, perhaps. So that's basically it guys, it's just a new feature that I found pretty cool and it's something I've been waiting for for a long time. Um, but check out our other videos on Copper vs Glass, please subscribe um, and we'll catch you guys in the next video.